What's up guys? I'm gonna give you a quick rundown of my just about complete blue disc golf cart and bag and disc setup. Been working hard at this. When you suck at disc golf, but you love it and it's your only hobby, you tend to do crazy things like just spend all your money on it, at least I do. So, you know, when I show up to the course, I might not be playing great, but I'm looking great. That's all I got. That's all I got. And it's cold and it's winter time, so I'm bored. So let's get to it. This is like an MTV Cribs, but for my disc golf cart. Uh, first off, Dynamic Disc Combat Ranger bag. This is like the greatest bag I've ever owned. Y'all can keep your pounds or whatever. This thing has been perfect for me. I can give a full rundown on this bag another time, but right now I want to show you how I have it set up on my cart. They added some features and fixed some things, made some improvements, and this thing is awesome. I love it. But now it's going to sit on a cart most of its life. Uh, anyway, we'll start at the front, man. Um, so I've got this uh, JBL Clip 3 in blue. It's not as blue as I want, but it's blue. I've um, got my cooler that will hold up to 12 beers if I want to. Um, I have a blue bag in here that I use to take my empties and garbage home with me. Pack it in, pack it out, guys. I'm tired of seeing garbage on all the courses. It's ridiculous. Um, let's see, upgrades. Um, well, as you can see, I hooked up the blue wheels. Those are looking sharp. Um, added the fenders, upgraded the water bottle holders. Um, let's see, upgraded some hardware that's blue, um, towel clip blue towel um, this is how I have my bag strapped right now so that's pretty fresh I got these putter clips up here hold the putters no they do not mess with your discs at all um, then I did this custom handlebar setup where I took a mountain bike handle and the existing handle uh, wrapped it in uh, back grip tape and basically modded that so now i can carry i have long legs those of you that know me know that that's a problem sometimes when you're pulling your cart your heels can click on it but not now because i can carry it from the side i can carry it from the center and carry it from this side it doesn't matter which way i grab it it's perfect it's convenient um so that's been pretty rad that was probably my greatest upgrade i think i've done to the cart and if zuka if you ever see this man any of you folks out there, fix that. Make better handles. Or at least offer them for sale or something so I don't have to do all these mods to, you know, get something that works better. So, there you go. Again, another shot of those gorgeous blue wheels. I mean, look at those things. Man, I'm looking so good. Uh, over here, I've got my stool. Stool held right there. I've got my bag tags kind of clipped back here. That's what I use that clip for. Um, I just switched to using the Judge like a week ago. I put it with P2s pretty much last four years, and I just sold them all a week ago, and just decided I was going to switch to the Judge, and now I'm in love. It's beautiful. Um, so up here, this is an H2O pocket for a bladder, but I keep my like approach discs or putter stuff like that off the tee. Um, there you go, beautiful Fusion Judge there, nice zone. Um, so I keep those handy up there. On the side, I kind of just keep my utility disc. Criminal, beautiful disc that I just discovered too. Too bad it's out of production. Uh, then this beautiful Dismania PD3 Glow that I dyed the other day. Got cool looking. Anyway, that's like my utility disc. Uh, I keep my main driver up here, which is Biofusion Raider right now. Love these things. They're awesome, still breaking this one in. Um, let's see, what else do I got in here? Ooh, old school Soft Justice. This is not the current run. This is one of the older runs. Uh, this is the most overstable mid-range. Actually, it's probably the most overstable disc I've ever thrown. It's amazing. Super trustworthy. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Um, here's a Lucid X Justice. This is another one of my favorite discs. Uh, I dyed this one, obviously. You can't get this uh, in this color, but that's amazing. Super overstable. Um... Another Verdict, again, I dyed it, but it's looking beautiful and fresh. Love that, it's a little longer than that. Um, 
Fusion Truth, I love this disc. I was trying to throw Emacs for a while. I decided I did not need something that stable since I already threw a verdict, so I went ahead with the Truth. I've been loving that. Um, this disc, I can't say enough about it, man. Casting makes some of the best plastic in the game. Uh, this is actually one of those super expensive mint first runs, but I died it. Some savage like that. So, anyway, I've been working that into my game. Loving that. Um, as far as drivers go, yeah. Night nice Strike 3. Essence, another one of my favorites from last year that came out that I've been loving. Uh, just threw an Explorer in recently. A buddy of mine was throwing them. I'm starting to get used to them, but I've been loving this. I mean, look at it. That's beautiful. That's gorgeous. And. Glow FD3, again, I dyed this. Um, so yeah, you can't get this, but it's awesome. If you can seek out the older run of Glow FD3s, you'll be happy. They're probably the most overstable of all of them. Um, old school PFN, Pat number, Star Orc. Um, yeah, this thing is legit. I don't know if you can see this. I'm gonna hold it up to the light, but. Yeah, look at that, you're gonna love that. Beautiful natural swirlies. They don't make them like that anymore. Um, this is my first Raider. This is from the original run. This thing is beautiful. Um, just now starting to get beat in, but this loose, it holds forever. Love it. It's still my baby. Breaking in the bio, but this one I love. And my bag would not be complete without this X-Cal. I have to have them. Always have them. Always will have them. Fuck wind. Can't handle it. There you go. Um, and then, yeah, over here. Shout out to my work. Um, lately, I've been drinking Keystone Light. Say what you want. I used to be a beer geek, but this is a beer I'm always going to have. Plus, it comes in a blue can, so. There you go. So, that's what I've been working with. Nobody cares, but I'm showing you anyway because it's wintertime. And that's it. I'm going to go inside now.